Hi, Super Spruce here, back on another Distance Incremental video, episode 8. And you can see I've gone a total of E80 universes, which is insane. And I have 6 million pathogens, so I can get quite a lot of these upgrades. I think the first thing I want to do is boost pathogen gain, just like a decent amount. Um, even that is soft caps, even though it didn't even need a soft cap in the first place. Yay! And I can't even purchase it. Because, you know, that's a hard cap. That's not a soft cap. Anyway, I probably should just do this. Rocket Gang soft cap starts later. Um, Rocket Effect soft cap starts later. Caver Gain soft cap starts later. And the Cadaver Effect soft cap starts later. And I can actually buy another tier of these. And that gets me an achievement. Corvid 20. Get wait, one of each of the 10 of... Pathogen upgrades. Pathogen, pathogen gain is 2.5 times faster. And also the gain of this is soft cap. So, yay. And I guess I just want to get a couple levels of these. I mean, actually quite a... Oh, okay. The next one is um, E6. This effect is soft capped again. So, yay. And then I should probably get these. I'm going to guess that these will be soft capped soon. Um, okay, they're, they're not yet. Also, I just got these. Whoops. Whatever. I probably can just get... Um, yeah, this is, this is a very weak upgrade. Just get the... Get this. Maximum velocity is boosted by your pathogens. And I already unlocked the dark circle. Already. It was that easy. How many rockets do I have? E50. How many intelligence? Yeah, get this down to two minutes. And there is the, um achievement for getting that and all I need is just 5e7 cadavers which I can gain e10 cadavers so uh yeah there is all the row six achievements and I have just unlocked the dark circle and I'm just gonna see how many time cubes I can gain oh there's new upgrades I can gain e70 time cubes time cubes and dark flow okay I need to actually check out what the dark circle is all about so, I have one dark flow, whatever that means. Dark matter amount, zero. Gain zero per second. Um, you gain one times as many rockets. Dark energy, zero. Gain zero per second. You gain more time cubes. And then um, dark fluid, amount zero. Gain plus, or, you know, what am I saying? Scale rocket fuel scaling starts zero rocket fuel later. So... What do I even have? Why is it not automating this? I should probably... I should probably... Why do I have zero intelligence? It, did I just... Is there just... Is this another prestige? No. I need E11 cadavers to unlock one dark core. So generation in the, in the dark circle is shown by the arrows. Okay, so they boost each other. Interesting. So, okay, dark flow boosts each other and time cube yeah dark flow which is this and time cubes boost each other i see and each component of the dark circle boosts dark flow scale tier scaling starts two tiers later so let's even see i'm at rank 56 but since i have no intelligence i can't do anything i yeah i need to actually gain stuff i can't i have i've gone a total of zero meters what is this? I can't do anything! What what has just happened? I feel like this game is bugged. I can't do anything. I can sacrifice it into life essence. And I... Okay, this is definitely bugged. Because... I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Oh, it's because... It's because I... Because I'm in time reversal, that's why. Whoops. Okay, uh, yeah, I gotta fix that. Okay, anyway, I, I, re I really thought I was bugged, but no, I'm not. I guess I'll just max all of these, and now I can maybe do stuff to the dark circle, hopefully, I think. Um, this cadaver game thing is actually really slow. Weird. I thought I was a lot farther than what I actually was at. I... Oh, yeah, I need, need time cubes. It's dumb that you need that, and boom, two more achievements. 
E140 universe, and then E60 rockets, and the times and exist reward is 75% stronger. So, yeah, I should probably t do time reversal more. It's weird that's not automated. But anyway, E12 cadavers, which allows me to get one dark core, which means all these three things are going to be boosting each other. Actually, I, I can get a few more dark cores. So this is going to allow me to get two times as many rockets, two times as many time cubes, and then more rocket fuel. I also get another achievement. Reach 50 dark matter. You gain time cubes without reversing time, but only at half the rate. Okay, I see. So I, that means I don't have to reverse time ever again, because that was really annoying. The whole, like, I, I thought the game was just bugged, but no. Up to rank 73 in tier 9, by the way. And I'm close to getting this. Each component of the dark circle boosts pathogen upgrade efficiency. It's 11%. Is that like per upgrade? That could be very powerful. Because this is currently at 1308%. Once I get this, now it's at 1439%. That's actually really good. I feel like I should probably actually get this. And now I'm getting 10,000 pathogens, and the upgrade power is 111%. So, yeah, I'm, I'm, it looks like I'm pretty easily gaining dark matter, dark energy, and dark fluid. However, um, the effect of them is just not very good. I should probably just get more cadavers, because I can, I can gain E13, so I'm going to get a couple more levels. There's another achievement. Five dark cores. Dark flow is 10% faster. This is E100 rockets. Rocket gain is increased by 2%. E80 scraps. And 75 normal rocket fuel. I have 51 rocket fuel. So, yeah. Oh, I can get another time reversal upgrade. <laughs> I could have already got it before. Um, tiers do not reset anything. Scaled tier scaling um starts later based on your dark cores and tears boost cadaver gain okay it's a 17 times boost to cadaver gain and tier scaling is even less so that means i can now now rank 75 tier 9 and i just need a little bit more so i can get scaled rank scaling starts 32 ranks later and, and all the effects of the dark circle are stronger based on your dark cores the next or the next mechanic here is infinity. So yeah, I need E308 universes to infinity. So yeah, that's gonna be interesting. I think I'm just gonna get some more dark cores. I'm now up to eight dark cores. Dark cores don't really seem to be that all that useful if they're if it's just additive. I feel like it is just additive, but it may be more than just like let's see. This goes from 1.74 to oh, it's it's multiplicative, three e4. So. Yeah, so they're definitely doing something, but they're just weak. They're, um, except I can reach this. I mean, maybe, maybe they're not weak, because even maybe five times as many rockets. I think it's just the scaled fuel, or scaled rocket fuel scaling starts later. Maybe, maybe it's that. But anyway, I can now get this, which allows me to um, reach super scaled rank 101. So... Yeah, interesting. And actually, you know, not, that's not 102. And that's about it. I can gain more cadavers, so I can get some more dark cores. I can get up to 11, but they're not also... Wait, it's not 4 times as many rockets. It's 4 or 5e5. E5. This text is so tiny. This needs, this needs to be bigger. Like, if I have a suggestion for the update, just makes it, make this text bigger at least these circles bigger because it's hard to read anyway i'm now getting quite a bit of pathogens so maybe i can do like the rocket gain soft cap starts later like i can go from e96 rockets all the way to e96 rockets so yeah that, that didn't do much i thought it was going to do a lot more than what it did but i should probably just keep gaining more cadavers so I can try to get more dark cores. I may just need to wait if I want to unlock infinity. I should probably also improve these bots. Because that will definitely help speed things up even more. 
So I'm, I'm up to 2e17 counterverse, but it's not enough to get one more dark core. I guess I can, yeah, I've seen these achievements. I'm just not quite there. Actually, I just got the this one. So boom, one more achievement completed. And well, I'm not really sure what else I can focus on. I mean, there's all the, in, there's like the infinity stuff. I, I guess I'll just look at some of these achievements. Like, let's see what some of the new mechan, what some of the mechanics are. Like, just, I'm trying to see if there's anything new. I, I don't really see anything. Oh yeah, there's the stadium challenges. I, f I forgot about those. Also, there's a new update. I forgot that, um, yeah, it does a bunch of stuff. There's an elementary I've heard about elementary. That's like a big one. And yeah, it's good. that'll be interesting. Theory point. Hadronic challenge. Quantum foam. I have no idea what any of those are, but they're there's something. Okay, I've gone to statistics and E238 universes, and it looks like there's scaling levels, which is ranks 100% starts at 92. Rocket fuel starts at 41. Pathogen upgrades starts at 10. Then there's super scaled, which starts at 100 ranks. So, yeah, there's a lot of cost scaling and soft caps in this game. I guess that's what the game is known for. I think I'm just going to keep grinding more pathogens because that's, I think, what I'm going to do. There's not really much else to focus on at this point. It's gotten a little bit slower. But I think with enough pathogen upgrades, I will be able to unlock infinity in the next episode. If, and if it's not the next episode, it will certainly be the episode after that. So, yeah, hope you enjoyed. Peace out.